Well, so much of the focus of public health is still on COVID-19 right now, but flu season is in full swing. We're learning more about the numbers being reported in Lexington today. The health department has only three lab confirmed cases, but that's a fraction of the whole picture, they say. We found out why for tonight's Big Story at 530. A new month, another fresh look at flu cases. The Lexington Fayette County Health Department reporting just three confirmed cases. It really can mislead the public when they hear that there are only three lab confirmed cases. Misleading, he says, for a couple of reasons. First, many people with the flu each year go unreported because they don't get a test at all, and that's always been the case. Second, though, the type of testing doctors and clinics are now administering, rapid testing, is changing things. Those tests don't get counted in the lab-confirmed cases. It's really worth remembering that these are only the PCR lab-confirmed tests, and so many medical providers now use the rapid antigen testing so they can get those results back in 10 to 15 minutes for people, and those aren't required to be reported to the health department. The rapid testing has been a result of people needing quick results to distinguish between between flu, COVID, or nothing. So the consensus is the flu is spreading beyond the three lab-confirmed cases in Lexington and in the state. Right now, the State Department for Public Health lists the activity for the flu as sporadic. And though a lot of attention remains on COVID, the flu can have severe symptoms in people, and health officials encourage a flu shot if you haven't already. The flu can make people sick for seven to 10 days. Some people can get sick a little longer. 